Hello again. Today we're talking about quickly solving a serious problem with the Range Rover Sport and LR3 along with many cars from before 2010, and that's connecting your phone so you can play music. Most Land Rover models had standard Bluetooth calling starting with model year 2007, as well as with some 2006 models. However, Bluetooth for audio streaming wasn't standard until model year 2012, with the release of the Land Rover Vogue and the completely overhauled infotainment system. That being said, for at least us L320 Range Rover Sport owners, we have been relegated to using an aux cable strung to the rear of the center console for our audio connection. And while this works, it's annoying to string up the cable constantly, and it gets caught on the passenger armrest and between the seats. It took an embarrassingly large amount of time for me to find a solution to this, and the solution is amazingly easy. It relies on the lucky proximity of a few components near the aux port. This allows for a powered Bluetooth connection that's totally hands-off and out of sight. You'll need to purchase two components, the most important of which will be a USB-powered Bluetooth to aux connection. This is the component that I had no idea existed until recently. Unfortunately, there is no USB connection near the aux port. However, there is a cigarette lighter. This is where the second component comes into play, and you will need a car USB adapter. Finally, with these two components rigged together permanently behind the center console, you should be able to connect the device and start streaming audio over Bluetooth to your car with absolute ease. Now when you or somebody else wants to play music, simply turn on your Bluetooth and connect it to the Bluetooth adapter you chose. In my case, it's called the Firefly adapter. This modification will also help with the newer iPhones that no longer have aux ports. This small change has saved me tons of fiddling with the aux cable recently and I'll never go back to using the cable. And I hope you can use it yourself to make your music listening life a little bit easier. I post videos about once a week so stay tuned for more. Don't forget to subscribe to the channel for tips, tricks, and repairs for Range Rover Sports and LR3s that could save you hundreds or thousands over taking it to the dealer. Thanks for watching and have a good one.